This segment of Panther Sports Talk is brought to you by Lincoln Savings Bank. At home in Iowa, at work for you. The UNI women's basketball team has been chosen for the NCAA tournament. It's the program's first ever at-large selection. Joined with UNI head women's basketball coach Tanya Warren. Coach, that at-large bid process, a little different situation than winning the conference tournament and knowing you're in the dance. It was a lot different, uh, but what a rewarding to see your name come up. Um, just to hear the cheers and, and see the tears is, honestly for me, it was priceless. It's something that I will always, always remember. What was that selection Monday for you? Was that a roller coaster of emotions, not knowing? <laughs> it was a long, long day. Uh, I didn't sleep a lot Sunday night, uh, and then Monday just it just seemed to creep by, and it didn't help that, you know, I said to our staff, just think about this, we sprung up an hour on Saturday, imagine that, so it was a long wait, but ex well worth it. Well, your Panthers finished 20, uh, with 24 wins at the end of the regular season and, and conference tournament. Uh, your team has just done so much work from the start of the year to the end, uh, the whole season, the wins that you guys came up with, you guys were rewarded with an NCAA tournament bid because the, the kids earned it out on the floor. I agree. Um, you know, only God could write this script in terms of uh, this being our youngest team in eight years, uh, really inexperienced, uh, three seniors, uh, but every single day they came to work, they gave us everything they had, they believed in the process, they believed in the system, um, and it paid huge dividends for us down the stretch in terms of the work that they put in the overall body, not only in conference play, but what we were able to do in not conference play with top 25 wins over Creighton and K-State. Uh, you take Drake to double overtime at home and then obviously overtime in the conference tournament. Uh, just a tremendous season and I couldn't be more proud of this team. Coach, you're coming off that Missouri Valley Conference Tournament uh, overtime loss in the championship game, but uh, do you feel your kids are playing some of their best basketball now? I do. I thought we was tremendous in the tournament on both ends of the floor. Uh, you saw different kids uh, step up. Uh, our offensive rhythm was, was very good. I liked how we defended. I thought we rebounded. We did a lot of good things. Um, it just didn't, didn't go our way. It wasn't for us to win that game on Sunday. I mean, for, for Ingo to make the shot that she made, we defended it the way we wanted, what, the way we needed, when doing anything different there. It just wasn't meant for us to win. Um, and it's hard in that situation, uh, but we knew that we left it on the floor, and as I told him, uh, we're, we're champions regardless, and you walk out of here with your heads held high. And Coach, you had some outstanding uh, performances in that conference tournament. Angie Davison, the senior, a career-high 21 points in the semifinal. She ties uh, a tournament record with seven three-pointers. She's named to the all-tournament team. It was just a huge spark for you this past weekend. And she did it all. Uh, she shot the three extremely well. She rebounded. She defended. She came up with hustle plays. Um, she literally performed like this was her last go around. I, and I couldn't be more happy to see Angie perform that way. We've known all along that she could shoot the basketball extremely well. It was just a matter of her finding her groove and she found it at the right time. And then Madison Weekly also on the all tournament team, a first team all conference selection. Her, Ellie Herzberg, a, a number of Panthers really. We'll get into them a little bit more later, but um, Madison just a fantastic tournament as well. She did and, and Maddie's had a, a great year. Uh, you know she moved from the two back to the point guard uh, and her sister turnover ratio is outstanding and she averages double digit points. The little things that that young lady does uh, does not always get recognized but boy uh, she's I'm so glad to have had the opportunity to coach her for the past four years she's a tremendous tremendous young lady all right we'll have more with coach Warren coming up right after this the Panthers in the NCAA tournament for the third time ever in program history back with more here on Panther Sports Talk <laughs> 